Hey everybody, AmpReparaGuy.com, 203-892-4119. <clears throat> so, what we have here is a, an Ameritron AL82. In the last video I told you I lost my memory card, so I had taken a video of this before I started doing anything, I ended up losing it. So, I started working on this thing. Um, I want to do a two-part video on this. So, here's the plate blocker assembly. It had sharp corners. I ended up clipping off the corners and filing them down. The resistors are good there. There's damage to the plate tune capacitor. Major catastrophic damage to the output band switch slash rotary switch. So that all has to come out. I'm waiting on parts. It's been killing me here. I have a lot of stuff to do and I'm waiting on parts, parts, parts on multiple amplifiers. So getting through things as quick as I can as the parts come in. So in these amplifiers I have more room so I ended up I ended up putting in a 50 ohm series glitch resistor. It's a canthal type resistor. Got the clips here uh, that hold it in place and then these pieces here that stop it from ever popping out. Ample clearance between it and the blower and it and the top cover. New wire to the plate choke, base the plate choke. You always want this resistor to be of ample size. You don't want this to open. You don't want this to be like a fuse. So tubes, needed new tubes. One of them had a grid to test the really low between the grid and the filament. They were the old brown base uh, china tubes They're around here somewhere. I don't even know where to put them. I got so many duds around here. It's not even funny. Oh, here they are. Here's one of them. There. So, it's getting new Penta Laboratory tubes. It has the grid overload board. I'm going to see how it reacts. A lot of people have me take this out because it tr it's so sensitive. It's not needed on an AL82. It's needed on an AL1500 because that has an indirectly heated tube, uh, an indirectly heated cathode tube. The 8877 has a fragile grid. Or on an amp, you know, if you if you still use an AL811 or 811H with 811 tubes, it you know it's a good idea on that too because those tubes are like just so fragile. At least the Chinese ones, the old RCA ones are awesome. But um, I wouldn't even work on one of those unless the customer is willing to swap over to 572. So anyway, I'm going to see how it reacts with the board. I may end up taking it out if it's too touchy. It just irritates people when they're going to tune it. Trips, 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 trips. You know, so. I will check the SO239 connectors, I will check everything else, and I'll be back with a second video. This is an older one, uh, I'm sorry, a newer one, it does not have the, um, the older ones use the Peter All, so this has the newer one. Actually, this guy said he bought this online, came from California, this gentleman lives a uh, state away, and um, he said it actually came with the tubes installed, the chimneys installed, and the transformer installed, and somehow it made it it's amazing um, when you go to ship one of these you're supposed to take the transformer out put that in a box take the tubes out pack them well put them in a second box chimneys in a third box and amp in a fourth box and ship them all separate I don't actually need chimneys if someone ships one I have a couple here for testing amplifiers so so that's that so I'll be back when I get the rotary switch and the air variable and I'll make another video showing it completed. So a lot of people have been asking me where I've been. I've just been so busy. I have another AL811H2, an AL80. I have a Collins 30L1 upstairs, uh, AL572 upstairs. I'm just running out of room here and I have more stuff coming. Still takes me about two weeks. Just depends on yeah, I get the amp here, order the parts, and then I get on it when the parts get here. So I'm very fast, but I'm very thorough. I make sure I go through all of it. I don't skimp. I don't. I don't cut any corners. Period. So, thanks for watching. Website is ampreparguy.com. 203-892-4119. I'd appreciate it if you like, share, and subscribe. If you end up subscribing, you'll see right away when the next video comes up. Should be next week. Hey, take care. 73.